Okay guys, we're out here in the shop. Uh, we just got everything wired up and uh, we're about to push a button for the first time. And uh, super, super cool moment right here. We're all excited. Um, we're just going to see how this goes. We got the um, bump bar wired in. Um, it's ready. So let's see what it does, see if it makes noises. <laughs> Right now we're just trying to get fluid in it. All right, we got a leak. Got a leak? Yep. All right, this you come back in here, we're good. That's good, man, that's cool as I'll get out. <laughs> we got a lift. Moving! <laughs> Where's the leak at? It's over here. Oh, that's pretty cool, man. We're making noise in there. <laughs> yeah, man. Let's go over here. <laughs> yeah, we might have to go get some more. It's sucking juice right out of there. It's sucking it up. Yeah. You probably will. When do they close? What? When do they close? Uh, Banks were closed at nine. Advanced store? Yeah. I don't know about that. Pull your locks, they'll go on down. It's still, if you notice it though, it was going to still in this right here. Yeah, and it's got all the fluid. It ain't got all the air out of it yet. Yeah, plus your little fluid on top of that. So. Yeah. Try it again. Arms are always nice. Amy, stop. Right. Amy. Amy's gonna tell you about it. Amy, you gonna help me out here? The left screw needs to go on the right hole. Oh, 
Oh yeah. That's what she told me. <laughs> I bet she did. <laughs> Hey guys, what's going on? Um, we just finally got the fluid run through it. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to have to get some more to fill it the rest of the way up so we can go completely to the top there. But uh, this is working good. We got it wired up. Um, everything is working good so far. Uh, tomorrow we'll put a vehicle on it and do a test lift there and see how we do. But uh, I'm excited. We're doing really good and this is a big, big step for us. Uh, also, UPS man came today, so we got some Coolio parts for the GTO, so uh, let's come on over here and look at those bad boys. Okay, ready to go? Hello, boo. So good. What you doing? Popping the bubble. Oh, Lord. Oh, yeah, guys. Check this out. We got a very nice care package that just came in. We got some really, really cool parts to put on the GTO. Just look at some of that sparkle there. Uh, we'll start over here. Uh, first things first. Ames hooked us up big time. Uh, definitely got to thank those guys a bunch. Sent some stickers and some magnets and uh, some keychains. I mean, they, they really hooked us up with some nice stuff. And definitely got to thank those guys for helping us out. Cool little keychain and uh, some real nice magnets in here too, if I can get those out. Yeah, check that out. Really cool stuff. Uh, we got new door handles, left and right side. New window cranks left and right. Uh, of course, we gotta get our GUR tag. Definitely has to have that. Uh, we've got new seal plates left and right side. Of course, super cool magazine. These guys really hook us up really good with a very nice colored magazine so you can look at all the parts and you don't have to get online. I love that, I'm old school. I like a cool catalog. Um, we've got our emblem. That goes on the fender there, and uh, that pretty much goes right in there, which is really cool. Very nice, very nice emblems. We got our rear quarter emblems. Very nice emblem, both left and right on both of those. And then we also got our interior badges that goes on the door panels. Very, very nice stuff. Um, Ames, they got really, really good stuff uh, to get from. Uh, moving on, we've got brand new door handles, both left and right hand side, and uh, that's super cool. So we're really excited about getting that stuff onto this thing and uh, really help us out a bunch on making this thing just really stand out. But uh, I was gonna show you guys one of the old door panels right over here. So you can see there's one of the old original emblems. And you can see right there, boom, 
just want to let you guys see the quality there very nice stuff and of course i'm going to keep all my old original stuff and we'll do something with that stuff but just wanted to show you guys the original door panels and stuff that was on it uh we got new trim to go right here too on the new panel but uh very cool stuff again thank you ames be sure to go and check them out and uh if anybody from ames watches this video again thank you guys so much okay guys well we're headed to lowe's right now last night you guys got to see us push the button on the lift for the first time and uh that was really cool to finally get to do that and uh we just got to go to lowe's and get some more hydraulic fluid so we can uh finish working on it and uh, we'll uh do a little bit of work on it and then we'll get back on the gto but it's time to get back on it just now so it's a pretty big moment um, went around all the corners just kind of checking everything uh, felt both the front and the rear just to make sure uh, the weight felt like it was just you know the front wasn't too heavy and it just wanted to flip off but everything felt fine so we're doing good something real neat with these arms right here where it's like an asymmetrical lift so like the problem is like when you've got really short wheelbase cars the opening from wheel to wheel you can't get the arms in but this lift here where it's asymmetrical you can fold the arms up against yourself and i'll show it at the end of the video so you can pull a small wheelbase car in because believe it or not this legacy was going to have that problem and you couldn't even lift it normally but um, with this style of lift you can lift a short wheelbase car so it's good it's good Oh, super cool, a lot, of late, a lot of weight just lifted off my shoulders, can't even talk right, right? <laughs> pretty exciting moment, Yeah. really cool. No concrete's busting up, we don't have no leaks, all of our hydraulic lines are looking good, it lifted up even too, so that was cool, so I'm pretty much right on the money on that. <laughs> Cool. Okay guys, so first project on the lift here. I know a lot of you are probably laughing at me. I got jack stands on all four corners of it. Until I get used to this bad boy, uh, we're going to be uh, extra safety there. But anyways, uh, first job on here I needed to do was uh, brakes on my car. And uh, this is just my daily and uh, sure enough we got some brake pads that are bad bad back here see if I can get them off here and show them to you yeah yep I think they're gone uh, I think they're gone let's get this nasty grease monkey work done and uh, get back to some cool stuff okay guys there we are we got the car down uh, our brake job is done we're ready to go do it for a test drive and uh, there's what I was talking about where the arms just fold back. You can just kind of see. Here, I'll show you a demonstration here. See how it just swings in and out, just like that. And then you can just swing them in. So that way when you pull a short wheelbase car in, you can just swing both of them in and it can fit under the short wheelbase car. So super cool. We got that done. And uh, now we can start using this lift more and more in the shop. Super excited about that. Super excited about it. So, uh, I think we're going to end this episode off on here and then we're going to start working on that. So we're going to break it up in two episodes here. So the lift install is done. Boom. There we go. So again, thank you guys so much. Uh, this episode will go up pretty soon and then we're going to work on, excuse me, we're going to work on the door panels, door handles and all that stuff, getting it on the car, get the emblems on there and we'll show you guys some, excuse me again, some really cool stuff. Again, here's the new door panels. So we got some really nice stuff going on it. And we're just getting this stuff fitted on so all that stuff works. And then uh, 
we'll take all that off because there is a lot of stuff that's been modified inside the car and that's the reason why we're going ahead and making sure that all this stuff fits before we start uh, you know doing our detail finishing work on it but uh, we are rocking and rolling be sure to like share and subscribe if you have not done it yet I'm gonna put the subscribe button right here in this corner be sure to subscribe that helps us out a ton on the channel and until uh, next episode you guys have a good one